a jellyfish stranded on the beach. Water is the most powerful source of energy, the one where energy always flows wild and free, according to the laws of nature. But the jellyfish is stranded on the beach. The jellyfish fights against the current, trying to release itself. But the jellyfish is stranded on the beach. And in the moment the jellyfish decides to go with the current, in the moment, it decides to flow itself within the rhythm of nature and the universe, the jellyfish is washed away to a path of freedom, love, life and immortality. Nothing in the universe is permanent and everything lives just enough time to die. This is the organic process of growing. The world grows slowly out of the old into new shapes and forms. Everything in life serves a bigger purpose. The laws of nature. We are raised to believe the natural world is something we don't want. We are raised to believe the world is a bad place. We are raised to believe in fear and the lack of trust within ourselves and our society. If we just trust and follow the path and the signs of the universe, we are following our true long lost inner nature. That's what we did on this day. After Yo-Yo's third failed attempt to cross the Atlantic, he had a big realization that his very own challenge to hitchhike around the globe was taking away his freedom that he was looking for. So, he liberated himself from his self-restricting rules to follow his true inner nature of being free. My project will continue and only got stronger after this event. So, whenever we are able to leave the country, we are going to fly to the American continent and resume our around the world trip there, still in the course of West. Despite all of what happened, one thing was sure in my mind. Crossing the Atlantic almost became a pilgrimage, in a way. So maybe it could be the last thing I could do on this around-the-world trip instead of the first. Who knows the future, right? We are with our wings open with the wind. I will face you again, wild Atlantic Ocean. And in the next time, I 
promise. The wind will be in my favor. So, the next time you confront yourself with a bad situation, just remember, everyone has its own chi, the energy that sustains life. And the only thing you have to do is to release yourself from your social identity. Doesn't matter the past or the future. They are only pure illusions, and in the moment you try to control them, you lose control of yourself. So I ask you, who do you want to be today? Unconditional love for yourself, the others and the world is what happens when you are in harmony with the path of the universe.